part of this spectacular scenery. I mean, we're about 30 k's out of Tom Price and I just cannot believe the scenery in this part of the world or of Australia. Even me, it wouldn't consider myself a greenie fine and hard to accept that we're digging this planet up at an alarming rate, making billions of dollars through all and all. But really, what are we doing? Overall, I think we're ruining the planet. And um, I don't think anything's going to change, but I mean, you got to look at this place to believe it. And as I said, I, I, don't, I don't quite understand why we're digging holes here, there and everywhere. I can see why the Aboriginal people or the Indigenous people find this land very sacred. Uh, I can truly feel and understand why they believe this and I think they're 100% right. I, um, I've never travelled through this part of the world before and I'm finding it absolutely, it's just out of this world. I just can't even begin to describe how good this part of the world is. I, I really can't. If you've never been here, you, you've got to get up here and um, see it for yourself. And maybe you too might think the way I'm thinking. Um, I never would have even considered thinking about what we're doing to this planet. But now that I'm seeing what I'm seeing with my own eyes, I think we have to have a good look at ourselves as Australians and as people to really pay attention to the earth, look at it, look at better ways of resources. Um, digging the planet up continuously for money and greed for a handful of people. I know people will say yes, but it's part of the economy and, and all this. But there's got to be another way. It really does. There has to be another way. Because I don't, I don't see how we can destroy such beauty like this. And that's, that really is what the mining industry is doing with it. <coughs> you like it or not, there's no other way of looking at it. We are just destroying the planet. And as I said, I wouldn't have thought quite as strongly about it as I do now if I hadn't seen it from my own eyes. And, uh, can't say it enough. I really just can't say it enough. Just have a look at this video and tell me what you think. The land is just unbelievable. Anyway, that's my little rant and rave for now, but um, I hope in the future we can have a look at uh, another way and maybe people like myself who are a little bit older quite understand but maybe the young people have got it right when it comes to the environment um, because it's everybody's future at the end of the day if we keep doing what we're doing there's going to be nothing left we just can't keep digging holes it's like putting a hole in a, in a, round, uh, a round foam ball and we'll be punching up holes and it eventually has to deteriorate to, the, to where there'll be nothing left It'll just crumble and that'll be pretty much the end of the earth. Now this might take millions or hundreds or thousands of years, who knows? But to me it stands to reason if you keep putting holes in the earth, even how small they might seem on the big scale of Australia and other continents, they just can't go on forever. So we've got to really stop and have a think, wow, what are we doing? Anyway, I'll sign off for now, and that's uh, Swanee Torben from the uh, north of Australia, or part of north, I should say northwest of Australia, really. Um, and uh, anyway, that's my story. Swanee signing off. Goodbye.